Joan? Where's Joan? Isn't she supposed to be here? Oh gosh, am I too late? Good morning everyone, I'm so glad you're here today. Here we are the month of March and we have so much going on I can't wait to tell you about. Today we have two very exciting things happening. First, now through March 12th, we are joining in the Annie Armstrong Week of Prayer for North American Missions. This one hits me close to home because down in Fort Walton Beach, my own son is a church planner at Sunrise City Church. You probably received a pamphlet when you came in this morning which highlights some of the missionaries located throughout North America. There are prayer requests for them and information about what their missions are. Each day focuses on a different person, family, or prayer request. Would you please join with us in praying for these people this week? If you didn't happen to grab that brochure on the way in, be sure and grab one on your way out. Second, tonight is Laugh All Night Comedy Tour. This event is free and it's for all ages. There will be three different Christian comedians with us to make sure our sides hurt. This is not for the stick in the mud or the sour-faced Christian, unless you're willing to change. The Christian life is meant to be fun. So why don't you join us at 6.30 and let's have a blast together. All right, men, who likes to eat? And who likes to be encouraged with the Word of God? Well, you can do both. Friday, March 10th is the annual Men's Beast Feast. You will meet across the street to eat meat. Get it? Meat. Meat. Anyway, meet in the Yak Auditorium for a great night of meat, food, fellowship, and encouragement. Todd Wright will be the speaker for the evening. So make your plans to be here Friday night at 6 o'clock. So now that it's March, it's almost time for spring. I love spring. The warmer temperatures, the grass is going to turn green again, the flowers are going to bloom and we get to spring forward. Now I know this is usually seen as a sad event. We lose an hour, but then the sun stays out longer at night. So it's not losing an hour of sleep, it's gaining an hour of sun. Don't forget to spring those clocks forward Saturday before you go to bed. And then we'll see you right here at 9 o'clock for life groups and then 10.30 for worship. On Sunday, March 19th, we're going to have Friend Day. So you can invite your friends and your friends, your friends, your relatives, your acquaintances, and your neighbors. Start inviting all of your family, friends, co-workers, neighbors, waiters, waitresses, you know what I mean, everyone. We'll have Evangelist Junior Hill with us that morning during the worship service. He is truly an anointed servant of God. You're not going to want to miss out on that great morning, so make sure that you're here with all of your friends. Thank you again for joining us here at Second Baptist Church. As you can tell, there's a lot going on, so you can refer to your bulletin or your church magazine, or you might want to go to the website, which is secondfamily.tv. In the meantime, we hope that you're encouraged and enjoy your worship experience with us. All right, that's it for me. I need to get back to the orchestra. I'll be there in just a minute, Manuel.